so many skins over some of these characters, like, and it would make people happy because they get to just play that character even if it's not like a totally new moveset. I, I personally think Ultimate is solid enough a platform to turn into more of a service than a game. Yeah. Where you just continue to add characters, you continue to add skins, you start to monetize it that way. I don't, I don't know, man. I just think it's a great game. But here we are. Nico versus Ant, who's already uh, showing his feelings about the best of three. Via his pack. Rip, rip me. Hate to see. Ant got to have a little bit more confidence than that. He, after all, he's made it this far into the bracket. Far enough to fight off against Nico, so definitely yeah, no like, slouch. As far as matchups goes, this Yo. isn't villagers. <laughs> Worst. I mean, like the the hitbox of a slingshot is large enough to where he can reasonably challenge some of the advanced options from Schultz. But uh, you are playing against Nico, yeah. so yeah, arguably the best Schultz in the world. But Ooh. even God's fall and that axe yeah. is going to eat up Nico's first stock, and man, only at sixty percent. And was like, I don't care how big that sword is. This axe is large enough. Getting a lead so far. Maybe he feels a little bit of confidence. He's, he's looking for the parry hard. He's like, all right. Shield on, shield off. Looks off the platform, down the right. kid stuff. <laughs> right. Parry dodges back to the stage, gets around the, the call in the area. Down throw. No art just yet. Smash lets you know what's on his mind. Yeah. Cleaning up that stock. Only 50% to make up for here. Not too bad. Man. He really loves using these platforms because it's a surprise golden ball. More often than not, to catch someone off guard. And the aggression which we're seeing from Ant, of course, mixing in a little bit of passive gameplay as well with the flanking here by the ledge. But in general, he has been in Nico's face the entire time, and it has been to his benefit because he's able to shut down anything Nico wants to do before he does it, such as put him off stage and to get that edge guard. Really, really easy stuff with the Smash Monado art too. Right. Gonna be an even earlier kill. I mean, in a lot of ways he has to. If he plays passively at all, he's just gonna give the stage to Nico and find himself, find himself in a position exactly like that, where it's like he used Smash, and he's like, oh no. But, taking a fight to him. He's starting to fall behind. Nico enjoying the advantage stage pretty consistently at the back half of game number one. Slingshot trying to slow it down. Buster gets a few more percentage points on the board for Ant in this case. He's got to get the stock off. Yeah, 150% on Nico. Uh -oh. I mean, uh -oh. one Nico quick exchange make things. all the difference. Gets the roll. He had the read, didn't have the option there. That could have been a down tilt, an up tilt. A number of ways he's gotten the stock there. Nico still enjoying the second one for the moment. How often we see Nico just hanging out here on the ledge waiting for Ant to get back on. Nice, I love that slow turnaround. Shield uh -oh. waits for an option and then gets uh -oh. the grab. Also, incredible sequence at the end there after getting that grab, putting him off stage with the back throw and eventually getting that edge guard with the up B. So. If it was any other player, I would solidly put that last stock into the category of we take those. <laughs> But Nico is the caliber of player. I think he 100% oh, calculated. hung out down there off screen to bait out that low recovery. Absolutely. To get that up. I think that was the play. I don't think that was happenstance. Nico's I mean, a beast, man. It is a really good option to go for in general um, because it covers so much. Like, you know that Schultz's going to make it back, and he has the two swings, the upward swing and the sideways swing. So it's incredibly hard to deal with as the opponent that's trying to recover. Uh, you really just have to be ready to tech sometimes. I, I would be dead. Yeah, yeah. There's, I wouldn't expect short, might, like. I might tech, you know, like 50%. Like I know 50 he, he could pop back out, but that was Chris, man. Yeah. Clean play out here. Nico, I guess that rest paid off for him. He was hanging. He was knocked oh, yeah, out back yeah, here. Yeah, he was sleeping. Three. He was slumped. Well, here we go. Game at number two. We're moving over. Well, staying on PS2, rather. Uh, I'd love to see some more stage variety, if I'm being perfectly did, honest. Did he just shield through that for like a split second? Oh, for sure, yeah. The buster. Yep. Nico's a DJ. It's a mixing it up. All 
Yeah, you know, as long as you don't tech that, you're gonna catch an up tilt for your trouble. Smash Art comes out, looking to play. 77% the right smash attack back on the second stock. Right. Maybe even like a like an F tilt by the ledge probably would have been enough to take the stock two in Smash Art. You don't even need Smash Art, man. He's got a forward air jump. in jump, and that's gonna do it. Up Pulling tilt. the ball two pixels off from finding its way in home. Slowly but surely starting to run away with this. I feel like the offense is slowing down for Ant, and this is the exact part you don't want to see for Villager because it just, Nico just sets up. His threat range is so huge with these hitboxes. He's just like, I'm just going to chop you off stage and see what happens. Just the bowling ball, and trying to find some momentum going. Louis Rocket and the bowling ball to try to stop the return. Nico says, No thanks, I, I want to flip. This back throw right here, trying to set up for this edge guard, but an aggressive return to the stage by Ant, successfully getting the down air in and another Stop. axe, man. Where you at? Nico out here looking like a cherry tree right now. <laughs> Wait, what kind of tree did, uh, did uh, George Washington chop down? I want to say it was a cherry was tree. It a cherry tree? I want to <laughs> say. So Ant looking like George Washington. <laughs> Trying to get them dead presidents, man. He's like, I'm trying to make it fast. Nico, go see what I can do. <laughs> Slingshot, Schultz in check for the moment. Up B. Ooh. It's to save the environment. We're out here playing for trees. Yeah, man. I mean, there was that whole trend of uh, save the trees going on on YouTube. Ooh. Mr. Beast. And, and sponsored by Mr. Beast out here. <laughs> We're team trees out here. 151% on villager. He's like, I I'm done with this. Real like he just wanted to jump off the stage. Almost committed Sudoku. Stop, not gonna do it. Oh, yo. Uh, okay, he'll make it back. He'll make it back. I, I really like the patience from Ant, who delayed his recovery, knowing that if he tried to go straight to the ledge, he was probably gonna get stage spike by the up B again. But it didn't matter because as soon as Nico grabbed that ledge, just went for it okay. again. Got that hit, it was a rock solid play by Ant. Any other art, that's a stock. Nico, uh, not the one, not one to get caught unawares like that. Though. He's gonna pick up the second stock, and I mean, you look at you look at the percentage, look at things, and it's feeling neck and neck. You know, it's felt like Nico's been in control, but Ant's been. Very much for yeah. so this, this game, I mean, he's either Jump. taking the stock first or he's just, uh, you know, taking it right back immediately after losing it. So really keeping it tight to the chest. 90% though, what's he gonna do to get back to the stage? Get up attack on shield goes unpunished. Ooh. I think if he waited about a quarter of a second, that bowling ball was finding its way home unless jump came out. And Ant's been going for a lot of really ambitious uh, roll reads. This is cheeky. Yeah. With the up smash consistently throughout the night, they haven't quite been working out, but I can appreciate the jump. Throughout the old potted plane, he said, you can Oh, there it is. That and then Nico said, you can catch this back here. But no, th there was a very real avenue where Nico gets caught flat-footed with that smash art out and the bowling ball or the berry hits. Yeah. And he suddenly finds himself in game three. Yeah. I was a little worried for your boy. I wonder what Vance is like 